We have some new friends. We're gonna be hanging out with them all day. We have no idea what's in this right now. Dear Michael and Rebecca, we are pleased to inform you that you have been accepted to a private event hosted by the Hogwarts School of Witch Captain Wizardry. This is cool. <laughs> Maybe this is every day. Windy! We made it past security. Finally! They wouldn't let her bring in her wizard wand though because that's a dangerous weapon. <laughs> I don't even have one. That's why I'm here. I need to get one. Yeah, we need to get a wand for you. <laughs> Characters walking around. I love that. Okay, so today we're at Universal. We have some new friends that helped us to get to Universal today, and we're gonna be hanging out with them all day. And their so channel this is, is their called family. <laughs> we are Jones Family Travels. I'm Tim. I'm Allison. I'm Hunter. I'm Kelly. <laughs> And we homeschool our kids and have travel adventures all over the world. And we are so happy to meet up with the Beach House yeah. here at Universal today. Cool. Have some fun. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm going to have a link in the description for their channel. So you guys got to go subscribe because they go on awesome adventures They're all the time. They're traveling all the time. Definitely. And they actually made a really cool, what is this, a treasure hunt? A scavenger hunt or something? Yeah, it's like a treasure hunt. For us, to, okay. for here while we're at, at Universal. We have no idea what's in this right now. <laughs> It's a little bit scary. I, I didn't know what you were saying. You guys made this? We did. That's so cool. <laughs> Dear Here, I'll open it a little bit at a time. Okay. You want me to read it? Or do you want to read it? You can read it. Dear Michael and Rebecca, we are pleased to inform you that you have been accepted to a private event hosted by the Hogwarts School of Witch Captain Wizardry. Woo! To avoid detection by muggles, we are sending you this secret invitation. You may have to use your magic and your minds to find the meeting location. Here are a few clues. Head to London to find the secret entrance. Ask a Slytherin to sneak you in. I think we might have a Slytherin in favor. <laughs> <laughs> Make your way to Ollivander's and gaze across the alley. Look for the sign pointing you inside. Yours sincerely, Professor McGonagall, Deputy Miss. Yay! Awesome. Okay. <laughs> this is cool. <laughs> Head to London, right? Yep. That's the first clue. Going to London. See you guys in London. <laughs> London, and we're trying to find the secret entrance right now. So we just saw a creature up in that window, super, super creepy. This is really cool because they know this world much better than we do. Yeah. They've been here like a lot. So the next thing we have to do, That's head fine. to London to find the secret entrance and ask a Slytherin to sneak us in. I think I see a Slytherin. <laughs> <laughs> Is 
Is this the secret entrance? No, it's it. Oh, just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta run into the wall. <laughs> wow, I did not even know this was here. This is so cool. I just thought I was in London. <laughs> this entrance really is kind of hidden. This is good. If you go back in there too, you can hear the bricks actually moving. Yeah, I heard way. that. Yeah. The leaky cauldron is leaking right now. <laughs> so we made it to the secret passage. Now we have to go to Ollivander's and gaze across the alley. Look for the sign pointing you inside. Let's go. We found Ollivander's. Oh, did we? Yeah, it's right over here. We're at Ollivander's. What does the note say to do next? To look across the alley. We look for the sign pointing you inside. Pointing you inside. Okay, so I'm looking across, just straight across, probably. I see a, I see a hand. Oh, there's a sign that says step inside over there. Uh. <laughs> I think that might be it. Moving pictures. <laughs> Wait, I missed that. What was that again? <laughs> cool. We finally found it. <laughs> this is the secret at the end of the treasure hunt. Now we're gonna take some pictures and have moving pictures. How exciting. <laughs> All right, so this is like a little Easter egg in Diagon Alley that very few people know about. Like, J.K. Rowling doesn't even know about this. Oh. That window that's under the speaker there. Uh-huh. There's a whole, like, London flat in there. Oh. And Universal will have, like, very exclusive special events up in there. There's, like, in there. Yeah. Wow. There's, like, a little kitchen and bathroom and little fireplace. You can't sleep there, but you, you can... I mean, it's like, and then you're up there looking out that window at all the people down here in Diagon Alley. <laughs> That's so cool. Yeah. since 382. Those flowers in the vase are fairly a bit dry. I've grown into... Very good. <laughs> 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 Not quite a... 
Result, we will be looking for. Good. And uh, definitely not your wand. <laughs> but you do have powerful magic areas, and these connections are quite complex. Fish and chips. No, oh, thank you. These napkins are awesome. So this is butter so beer pudding. I'm really curious how it tastes. Everyone has tried. Yeah. Pretty like awesome. It. I like the <laughs> taste. That's so cool. <laughs> I guess we found out that there are six different types of butter beer here at the park, and I totally guessed it right. He asked me how many, and I was like six, and he's like, that's right. You're a wizard. That's why. <laughs> Probably is. How did it compare to the butterbeer you made? Tastes like it. Like butter at home? Yeah. Did you guys know that if you buy a robe from Universal, it actually has a, an awesome pocket that actually holds the wand in it? Look at this. Right here. That's so cool. <laughs> I actually realized this right after I got the robe. I was just like, wait a minute, what's this? That's so cool! <laughs> the one thing about King's Cross Station is all the employees who are here, here are different from the Hogwarts Express because they can't say anything but magic because they haven't been on the they haven't been to Hogwarts before, so they can't say anything about Harry Potter. Probably 
wouldn't laugh. Yeah, that's okay. It looks cute. <laughs> and this happens. Uh-huh. <laughs> Big thumbs up. <laughs> I just want to give another huge thank you to the Jones Family Travels. These guys invited us to come hang out with them at Universal and it's been an absolute blast. You guys have been so, so much fun, fun to hang out it with. It's been game. really fun hanging out with you guys too. Yeah, so, and they taught us all of like the secret stuff that we would have never known. So it's pretty cool. <laughs> and I can't wait because we're going to be hanging out with these guys again at CVX Live yeah. in August. Yep. So if you guys are going to be at CVX Live, you'll get to meet them too. Because yeah. they're going to be there. Cool. Yeah. I'm looking forward to it. <laughs> We have a lot of exciting stuff going on And today. we're going to make a golden show. We are for my YouTube channel. Yeah! It's going to be a lot of fun. We're excited to do it. Let's get the patio cleaned up so we can do it. This is what we are working on. What do you think, James? It's good. You like it? I'm really happy I wanted to make one too. And I it like looks it. amazing. I like it so, so much. Oh. Ew. So this is what James's shield looks like, and it looks really cool. Looks like something from Game of Thrones. And there's mine. Ah, I'm in love. I love it. Now, James, we're gonna go and do jewels on them. Can we do yellow or golden spiked ones all around on the spoons? Maybe. Show us what you got, babe. Look at this. Ow. <laughs> it's the size of your face. Hi, Charlie. Charlie, come here. He almost ran right into me. Are those yummy? Yeah, those are pretty yummy. Can I see your glasses? You're so cool. Oh, yeah. Wait, I can see myself in them. When you my reflection show who I am inside. You're so cool. You're hip. Hipster, hip hop, like hippity hop, but I'm hip hop, hippity hip hop. Can I, I don't know how that goes. Can I watch that? Watch what, Mulan? <laughs> Moana, I want to watch it. You want to watch Moana? Yeah. I think everyone wants to watch Moana. Cause I Moana like is a good show. Right in it. Yeah, Moana. Moana. No, we're not gonna watch Moana. <laughs> we're gonna, it's too late for that. Ellie, up, up. What are you doing up there? Don't hurt me. Those are spoons, forks, and eggs. <laughs> yeah. We made a shield today out of spoons, forks, and an Easter egg. And spray paint. And jewels. Pretty cool. <laughs> I'm tired. I feel like for the last few days that we've been here, we've gone non-stop, crazy, like crazy people, trying to get the most out of our trip. And now, I'm really tired. But we just finished at Universal, not the whole park. We were able to do almost everything, and it was really fun. And we had our friends with us for, most, for half of the day. And then we went and just did a few more rides after that. But I am pooped out. Can you tell? Because I feel like whenever I get tired, I start talking slower. I want to hear more about how you blacked out on a roller coaster. That was pretty oh. crazy. I've never experienced blacking out on a roller coaster. So. It was just so weird. I was like, oh, I don't know. Okay, so we shot out of the Hulk. And on the Hulk, it like went so fast. And I don't know what happened, but all of a sudden my eyesight just went. And it was gone. And I was like, oh. This is, it was almost like I was closing my eyes, but I know I wasn't. After like a few seconds, I was like, wait, is my eyesight back? Is it back? And it was really super blurry and weird. And then, and then we went through the fog on the folk machine, or folk, what? Whoa, my goodness, I'm so tired. On the Hulk roller coaster, and then my eyesight came back really clear, and I was like, whoa, that was so weird. And then it happened again on another roller coaster, so I don't know, maybe I'm just getting too old and fragile for roller coasters. I don't wanna be old and fragile for roller coasters. I think you are old and fragile. I hey, you know what? Don't feel bad because I'm getting old and fragile too because there were a lot of roller coaster rides that I was on where I was like after the ride, I had like a little bit of a headache, or yeah. I was getting really dizzy. Well, I mean, it really 
jostles your brain. Actually, kind of feeling even sick, like I might puke. Yeah. When I was a kid, it was like non-stop roller coasters. Didn't phase me a bit. Yep. I think that maybe as you get bigger, there's more space for your insides to jostle about. <laughs> But when you're a kid, everything's all tight in there. It's, it's not going anywhere. <laughs> That's really funny. <laughs> all right. Well, I think today we've had a very successful. It was fun so much day fun. At Universal. The Jones, Jones family travels. Seriously, guys, they're such an awesome family. Yeah. I'm actually looking they forward to going and watching secrets. their videos. Yeah. See you guys tomorrow. We're gonna peace out. Pause, Pause the, the game. game. <laughs>